Okay, so let me go ahead and create a new project. And I'll call it uh, so GMS publish uh, subscribe tutorial or GMS pub sub uh, tutorial. Okay, and I'm gonna do finish. And here I'm gonna go ahead and create two classes. I'm gonna call the first one uh, topic producer. And it's gonna have a main method. And I'll go ahead and uh, create a second one. And I'm going to call it uh, Topic Consumer. And this one also is going to have a main method. So let me uh, uh, look at the, so the Topic Consumer. Uh, let's try to implement Uh, the message listener interface and we can so let's try to import uh, uh, javax package required dot so, so as you can see there is no GMS so to get the GMS uh, package we do this let me go and uh, go to uh, project uh, properties and uh, java build path and uh, libraries let me try to add the uh, library and it's going to be a server runtime libraries and there is no, none so uh, the way to get libraries here is to let me uh, create a server so let me uh, go here and I'm gonna pick JBoss 5.0 and I'm gonna be pointing it here to the JBoss directory for the 5.0 server let me use the GRE6 and I'm gonna do next and so the address uh, this is uh, essentially localhost 127.0.0.1 is uh, localhost and the port is that's going to be running on is 8080 and the JNDI port is going to be 1099 okay and the server configuration is the default the other option is uh, all or minimal okay so I'll do finish and uh, now I should be able to uh, do properties and come here in the libraries and then uh, add a library and server runtime so I have JBoss 5.0 so I can add the libraries associated with it and do finish and do OK so now let me try to fix the message listener so I should be able to do So we have GMS right now, so uh, javax.gms. So dot message listener. 
and so I'm gonna add the unimpl unimplemented methods which is essentially the on message method so let me go here uh, jbath 50 and server and default and uh, deploy and messaging and I need to change this guy the destination uh, service so let me open it up and I'm gonna edit it in Eclipse so I need to add an mbean here and this is gonna be an mbean for the topic that I'm gonna be using so the topic is gonna be uh, Zane Academy underscore JMS underscore tutorial underscore uh, zero one okay now this is what I need to add to uh, to, to have a topic that I, I'm gonna be uh, doing publish subscribe to okay so let me save it uh, let's close it and now let's let me start the server to test that everything is still running Okay, so it started, and uh, okay. Okay, so let me start modifying these two classes. So I have the topic producer and the topic consumer with uh, on message method. Okay, so let me first add uh, this method to the topic consumer. So the get initial context method. Uh, so let me fix these guys. Okay. So now I can get the initial context. So let me here. I'm gonna print a statement when this method when we go into main and another statement when we exit main. Okay, so now let me call the, this method that I got the get initial context. Now I'm gonna get a uh, topic connection factory. And the topic. And the topic connection. Which I'm gonna get from the topic connection factory. And the topic session, which I'm gonna uh, pick up from the 
topic connection so topic connection dot create topic session and uh, so I'm gonna use the topic session uh, to create subscribers and uh, for this topic okay and I'm gonna set the message uh, listener to uh, this class so as uh, so a topic consumer I'm gonna instantiate an instance new topic consumer so that uh, the on message methods gets called when uh, when 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 publishing happens to uh, this topic okay to the Zane Academy uh, underscore GMS underscore tutorial underscore zero one and, uh, next I'm gonna do topic connection dot uh, start okay so now let me go ahead and uh, handle the on message method add code here first let me change this name here to just call it message and I added this code which uh, so I'm picking up the message I'm casting it to text message and then I'm getting uh, the text that's coming uh, in this text message and I'm printing it out after printing uh, incoming message okay So I can actually test it even though there is uh, I haven't written the code for uh, for the topic uh, producer but I can I should be able to run this code now so let's go ahead and do that okay so we got uh, entering JMS example and uh, exiting uh, GMS example okay so let's go ahead now and uh, write the code for the topic uh, producer okay so now let me uh, I'm gonna do the same thing here I copy this guy So entering Jamath uh, example and exiting. Okay. So let me uh, add the get initial context and I'm gonna pick it up from the topic consumer from here so I'm gonna uh, use this this method the static method okay so So I got two, I got a uh, topic connection factory and also I got a uh, topic okay and the topic is uh, that uh, this topic uh, producer is gonna be publishing too it's gonna be the same thing top uh, Zane Academy underscore GMS underscore tutorial underscore uh, zero one And now I added uh, the topic connection so I'm using the topic connection factory to pick up a topic connection and then uh, I'm using the topic connection uh, to get a topic session okay and then calling uh, start on the topic uh, connection so next I need to create a method that I can use to uh, send messages So I'm gonna create 
uh, this message, send message, uh, which has a topic session. I have to pass it a topic session in order for it to uh, use it for the message. And I have to send it a, uh, I have to pass it a topic also. Okay. So I'm going to be calling it. Uh, see, passing a text message and a topic session and the topic, which is this guy. Uh, this is a topic, and uh, I passed it uh, this topic session also. Okay. So as far as the message, I'll send it something like uh, a message one from topic uh, producer. Okay. So here I'm gonna uh, create a call, create publisher on the topic session, passing in the topic. And then I'm gonna uh, use the topic session to create a text message, and which should be the text that is passed here, so it would be this guy. And then I'm gonna use the topic uh, publisher to call publish on it and publish the text message. From here. Okay. Okay, so let me try to uh, run this code. Okay, so I don't have, let's see, what, do I have the server up? No, okay, let me do this. Let me restart the server since I shut it down. So it started. Uh, let me go ahead and uh, start the topic consumer first. Okay, and then I'm going to start the topic producer. So here we go, so incoming message, message one from topic producer, and this is uh, the topic consumer here. Okay, so let's look at the other ones. So Let's look at the JBoss. So the JBoss received the uh, send and dump send. Okay. And if we look at uh, the topic consumer, it's entering and exiting and then incoming message. And then uh, if we look at the topic producer, it's entering and exiting and it. The, it uh, because it, it actually sends the message to the topic producer and the topic consumer listens and picks up the message okay so let me uh, what if I send more than one message let me do this copy this guy so I'll send message one and uh, message two and message three okay so here we go so it, uh, it still have and this is the topic consumer it still have the old message one and then it picked up the three new message one that I uh, just sent Okay. okay, so what I'm gonna do now is is uh, I have I created another topic consumer, 
So I'm going to be sending a message from the topic producer and uh, checking out uh, if uh, both topic consumers uh, receive that message and they should since it's a uh, publish subscribe so all uh, classes that are subscribed to that topic they should uh, receive that message that the uh, topic producer is sending okay so let me go ahead and uh, start the first topic cons consumer this is first topic consumer so it enters here and exits here the only difference with the second topic consumer is I'm printing out uh, topic consumer 2 and when it exits I'm printing out topic consumer 2 and it's the same uh, topic that uh, they're listening on okay so let me go ahead and uh, run the second topic consumer and here we go this is the second topic consumer and uh, I'm gonna run the topic producer to send a message okay so this is topic consumer 2 received that message let me go and look if topic consumer 1 also did the first topic consumer and it did so this is the first topic consumer so topic consumer this guy receives the message and the second guy 2 also received the message okay and this is uh, producer it entered uh, and exited and this is uh, JBoss okay so done sent and uh, received all that okay